Now we're gonna look at. Do they look the same? Or is it the same things to look at? What am I doing walking here? Oh, I wanna look at that mailbox. I wanna see if I've got mail. They're storing gasoline all over the property. Hmm. If need be. Can make it flammable. No mail coming in or out these days. Oh, no shit. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. Well, so that's the gasoline. That's the mailbox. We'll go over there in a minute. Let's look at the generator again, see if it tells me anything different. That thing keeps a fence electrified. God, it's like no shit. He tells me nothing. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Yeah. Especially if they have it as high as they said they do. Hmm, anything else to look at here? That's just gonna tell me the fence is pointing again, isn't it? Pointy. pointy, pointy. Of course it. You know, it's actually not that pointy. Let's look at this here. Does it let me look at it again? Look. Pointy. It's not pointy, pointy. Look at that top on there. That's super pointy. There's pointier fences out there. Okay, let's talk to them. They look happy. Of course they do. Talk to Kenny. Without getting hit by a duck. Hey. Haley. Found anything interesting? Mm. I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right. Provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more exactly. fence. Exactly. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around. And let me know if you find anything I else. guess it would give you some time to get a better fence in place while you have the electric one. Hmm. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna yeah, pass out. Yeah, we're not in a They've situation to be doing things. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Yeah, Lily doesn't like it. Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food. And I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. Exactly. You're with me on this, right? Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about I like Kenny. I'm siding with Kenny. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this Poor place. Poor Duck. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny. He didn't seem too worried about Duck when Larry wanted to throw him out into the street back God. in Macon. God! Bring That's that up. That's past, Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. It's like months I'm ago. Go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity didn't mean to, to find do that out a bit anyway. more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I, I can remember find every out. little thing that I don't side with you. I gave you guys food. Okay, let's go. Let's go talk to Clementine. If he had barely any energy to walk hey, here, how is he pushing like him? Are they not yeah, passing out and pushing them? Thanks for fixing what about the biscuits? You're welcome. The biscuits not making better. On it? Sure. Sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Okay. He doesn't like to share. At least I don't have to press any buttons hey, to make this swing going. I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be There's okay? his name, Mark. Got lucky out there. Got a bit of Mark's worse. got a big mouth. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. Hmm. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Nope. 
Not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. Why would I say that? Well, I guess reassure. Don't worry. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing you kinda, me. You gotta do little white lies to kids. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. Okay. Let's already talk to them, too. Could look at the pointy fence again. Let's go through here now. Come on. Hmm. What do we got? Ooh, hay. Lots of hay. Ugh, enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. True. But not from zombies. And a spigot. Looks like a spigot. I want to go in the barn now. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. I think the barn would honestly be safer. Only windows the zombies could break in through. Oh, I know what that thing is. It's those little circular hay Looks feeders. Like a feeding station for the cow. I heard they're not as good because the hay like sits on the ground there and like it gets all nasty and moldy on the bottom. But it feeds like multiple cows and stuff. They can like sit, get their heads through there. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of those type of feeders. Let's look at the corn. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Hmm. Let me get up in here. Come on, let me get up. Can we talk to him? Mr. Big Mouth doesn't have anything to say to us now, huh? What am I looking at? Wait. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. Gosh. He's like me. He just talks out loud to himself and what he's thinking. Lee. Oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get Very killed out there. I must think he's Do you crazy. Think Mark will be okay? Going around talking to himself. I, know, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? I'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. Sure you How have. How could you all bring us to this place? Take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. He's not gambling, he's trying to make the best decisions hey, for him. thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? You're a good leader, Lily. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions <clears throat> are in the right place. Still, it'd be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Look at that. I both told them they're good leaders. Hey. <laughs> That's going to come to bite me in the butt, isn't it? You're going to be like, you told me I should lead. You told me I should lead. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. Yeah, he likes it. He likes it because there's food. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I concur. I don't trust hey, these uh, people. Can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. Talk to you about your dad. He's a jerk. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Does he treat you like that, too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just, he's got a lot of pain. And that's he's how been he through so much it. and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself and me. Aww. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably going to keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. Oh, I now I feel for her. Now I feel bad. I feel bad. 
think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you think? Dad's right. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. No, no, not until we eat some dinner. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Before we eat, of course. Yeah, he just likes it here because there's food. Look at that. As soon as we get here, he's all Mr. Nice Guy. He's just one of those people gotta complain about everything. But if he was living here long enough, he complained there. Oh, this food is just a little bit too tough. Why can't anybody make that food right? Is everybody a complete idiot? <sighs> that guy's annoying. He's an ass. But now I feel bad because she let us know about his past and. Fellas, <sighs> how you feeling, mate? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Big box. Save lots. Yeah. Save lots. Anyway, they're nutty like as all Costco? and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Sure. Let's go. Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Of course we will. Well, he will. I have horrible luck. Hmm. See anything? Not yet. I see a tree. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Well, how does he know where it is? I don't trust him. Soup? Is that like alphabet soup? Here. Hmm. Oh shit, you found it? I don't trust him. Hmm. Hmm. A lot of boxes there. Sneak. How do we sneak? Well, it doesn't let me go sideways, it's just forward. Jeez. It tells us to sneak up, but anybody? it only lets us go forward anyway. Can't tell. Can't tell. They could be hiding anywhere. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Mm. Better not be a zombie in there. Where's my Q button? I got my finger on it. I should just keep my finger on that Q all the time. Oh. Empty. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main no, base. It's not. That's what I was thinking. It's like a couple people Take maybe. Take a look around anyway. From them. There's probably some shit around here. It's like here two sleeping bags. Stuff we're taking, huh? Let's look at the box. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. What did that say? Recently. Soup? Soup Express. Not name brand, I guess. No Campbell's here. Campbell's isn't even... Although I do like their tomato soup. Something about when I don't feel good. I just get me a just bowl of water. tomato soup. Some cheese. And some goldfish crackers. And lots of pepper. Oh, yeah. That makes me feel better. Let's go look at that stuff. And it's a box. Nothing. Yeah, so what is he doing always going around talking to himself? Empty. 
Everyone else must think he's absolutely nutso. What am I doing pushing things around? Well, why'd I push that? Why'd I do that? So I can't go back and look at it again? Looks like they expected to be here a while. Did I already look at this? I think I did. I looked at that. Uh, shopping cart. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. God, I'd hate to be trying to move stuff in a shopping cart through the woods. These things have tiny little wheels. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Hmm. Anything worth taking? 